all right, I'm, all right. Welcome back. What the hell is going on here? What is this? I don't recognize it's, it's this. Not, I, I'm I'm pretty sure it's camp. Yeah, I see that, but this is not base game. Hello. What do you got for sale, Santa? Is that Santa? I was going to say, is that Santa Claus? Reindeer bill of sale? Wait, I can buy it. Buy the reindeer. Do it. Add it to our zoo. To, I know. <laughs> yep. Oh, my God. Hands reindeer. Oh, my God. <laughs> Goodbye, Acer. Goodbye, Acer. <laughs> oh, my God. Now we just need seven more of these. There's a lot of confusion going on there. I, we were making our way back to Dawnstar, and I just got assaulted by bandits, and then there's... Now... Oh, my God. I wonder, does this support... Is this good? I, I just need to know. I love how... It, yes. it, <laughs> I love how it literally acts just like a horse, even though it's a reindeer. And Don't ask questions. Not... Don't ask questions. <laughs> Don't ask questions. Um, I need to make some decisions. I forget. Is this how I picked the armor? No. Decided. Um, this place is your home. I manage my inventory. Something was wrong with you. Now nah, you're all right. All right. I guess uh, we'll figure that out later. Um, we'll go <laughs> ahead and um, take a quick little uh, rest. While we're here in Dawn Star, it's been a minute since we've been here. You know, we've got maybe able to snatch a quest or two or something. Maybe, hopefully, slightly. Love how Acer just kind of fucked off. The hell are you? I love how his uh, pickaxe is facing right through his arm. Mm -hmm. Just don't ask questions. Don't ask questions. Don't okay. Let me know if you want. Give me the cleanest room you got, sir. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. That's okay. All right. We made it back to civilization for what felt like for forever. But only literally just to turn in one quest, but that's okay. I, we got a reindeer out of it. Mm -hmm. Hey, you got any uh, rumors? Have you seen the shrine of Azura? Okay. They say, let me know if there's anything else you need. Marcus, you're here. See ya. Hey. Baldi? Baldi? Burrito, yeah. Uh, well, I feel like I've talked to everyone. Probably. I just want to do it and get. I want to become Thane. I just want to be Thane. I don't know. I just want to be. I just want. Whoa, it's bright out here. Um. All right, where mm, is this usually guy? what happens during the day. Uncut. Oh, okay, to the ship guy. Oh yeah, I can sell a few things too to the smithy. I've been looking Whoa. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hand where did you come from, sir? Let's see here. It's from Falk Firebeard at the Blue Palace. <sighs> it's finally arrived. Friends in high places. Looks like that's it. <laughs> Focus. <laughs> Hi, Farkas. And the reindeer. And the reindeer. Ah. Uh, uh, he doesn't have a name. We'll name him or her. We don't really know yet. Um, is there anyone here? The elf. Uh, what's a good name? Like, I'm thinking. What's in. No. I mean, do you want to name him after one of Santa's reindeer, or do you like want to, you know? have to? That's the first bit of good news I've had since I set sail a year ago. Here's your I don't remember why you needed that, but thanks. <laughs> hey, twelve fifty. Damn, you were grateful. Oh god. Yeah, that's chump change. Oh my god. It, actually, it's just how much I paid for the reindeer, so it worked out perfect. <laughs> Hi, good old Smithy. No? How about a claymore? Uh, do you do any work for the ships? I worked on a few moorings here and there for you. Most of the ship captains are superstitious about who works on their vessels, and Dawnstar is known for its bad luck. 
We're the last port of call before Windhelm, and the war we trade makes rich target for pirates. Fair enough. You in charge of this forge? My wife Sarah and I run it together. She's still Smith's, even though we found out she is his child. Our son or daughter isn't going to get much Red Guard culture here in Skyrim. I know my wife worries how she will pass along her tradition. Hey, if you find a book called Night Falls on Sentinel, could you bring it to me? I it's probably have that somewhere. My wife's people. It's good to have. <laughs> it's the one book that you don't have. Good on you. I, I know I've seen it. <laughs> I know I've seen it somewhere. Is that on the horse? Or reindeer? I have to correct myself. Oh, I, it's, it, it, it's basically a horse, so. It's functioning as a horse, yes. But night falls on. Okay. I was curious if, like, you know, maybe it just wasn't registering it. Everything's in order. Mm. Ooh. I wasn't born nope. in Skyrim. Do you have anything to say? Or a call? Nope. Um. Oh, I wanted to sell you stuff. Did I want to talk to you? Oh, that explains it. What can you tell me about Dawnstar? I came here a few years ago from Hammerfell when I married. The land is beautiful, but I can't stand this cold. I don't know how Lustlake manages it. Well, is that your back I see right there? I think that's part of your problem. <laughs> You're from Hammerfell? Uh, what do you got for sale? So, Hammerfell is the province, like west of here right or i just whatever what did you do what did you do wrong did i sell okay i thought i sold my equipped thing for a second i was just worried um but it is the i think yes i think it's the province directly west of us um that's how it's high rock i'm blanking on it for sure but it might be both. It like could one be, is yeah. slightly north of the other one. Um, I think I already have some of that stuff, but Ooh, maybe I can sell some of these though. Pick off some weight from the poor old reindeer. I... Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage? Looking to make a buck, actually. Yeah, I'll sell those. Um, sell those. Sell those. Sure. Sell those. I don't even know if I'm making money off that. Sell that. Um... Oh well. All right. That's enough. Um... There's a child. Yep. One side coming through. Oh. Hey, you got stuff to say? Uh, where are your parents, kid? Uh, dead. My well. Was a sailor. Okay. On his last trip oh. After he got sick. That's rough, buddy. Good luck with that. <laughs> A few days later. Wow, no acknowledgement of the. I, I, I know ever. the. I get. I, I, I don't have to. It's just there. Um, what's the hurry? I'm running food and supplies to the miners. Don't pay much, but they let me sleep by the fire in the inn most nights. That's a little depressing still, but nice of them at least. Why? Why this? Um. Yeah. All right. Let's. Pop up a level. I hate the layout of Dawnstar. Um, can I talk to all of you? No one special. Beto thinks I drink on the job. Well, what is it? Do I have anything to smell? No. Okay, I was just curious. All right. Um. All right. What the? What? Is... They have it out for you. Jesus Christ! What is with all the wolves? That was weird. It looked like he just spawned in the middle of the city. Which is not supposed to happen, for the record. Yeah. Who are you? Just a servant of Who are you? I'm here to lend my magic to the people of Dawnstar. Maybe I have something to sell. You. No, you don't have me figured for a mage. I just you have me figured for someone that wants to sell stuff. 
Uh, uh, um, nah, I don't sell that. Ooh, I'll sell those though. Mm, I can sell. Yeah, I'll sell one of these. Nope. Look at me making some bucks. Next Imperial I see is dead. Oof. <laughs> I'm Scald's house, Carl. Not as dumb as you look. Thanks. Hey, I was talking to you. That's weird. Why are there's Imperials walking out front? That's really weird. Oh well. Um, where? Oh, where? Um, I think that's literally everything here. There's just nothing of interest were there, here. Were there any other quests that you needed to do? Not here, no. Did he say warm ale? We've stopped. What is it? Possibly. Um, I need to trade some things yeah, with you. Sure. Here. I think I might have some. Some ale for you. <laughs> <laughs> Spice wine. That'll work, right? There you go. We should keep moving. Hi there. Why are, where's your hat? Where'd it go? Oh, indeed. I work for the Wind Peak Inn. Oh my god, I'm so happy right now. Selling all my stuff. <laughs> Arjo, mm, should I? Should I? Should I? Should I? Should I get Carjo, or should I keep Parkus? What do you think? Uh, I would say Parkus for right now. Okay. Okay. Let me sell that and my poisons. I don't have my like really expensive ones, unfortunately. I have any magic I have to go ahead and look for that. Potion of magic. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um I'm not selling my brain deer. <laughs> not in a million. Especially years. not for hundred and ninety-three Yeah, oh. no, really. Talk about a ripoff. I spent over a thousand on that bad boy. I was told this reindeer was worth a thousand gold. Are you saying I've been had? Uh, honestly, I'll just sell both because I don't really care that much. All right. Thank you very much for all the money. Such a waste. All right. Marcus, you're walking. Can I oh. get Acer? No. Acer's gone. Yeah, I have no clue where Acer ran off to. See, is this Santa? I think it's Santa. It has to be. Like, I mean, I realize that the hat is blue, but I mean. Okay, I've got to know something. Don't try and kill Santa. Holy shit, that's a massive frostbite spider. Giant frostbite spider. Santa, help. This frostbite spider is getting cold for Christmas. <laughs> That'd be the best one-liner of all time. I mean, maybe that was in... Oh my god, look at the game page this guy went on. It's better than you having to deal with it. Is there an invisible skeever? Do you hear that? Okay, it's gone now. That was weird. I heard like the breathing of a skeever and I was very confused. Maybe it was Farkas. You know, I want to put it past Farkas. Alright. Okay. Oh, okay. What were you thinking before you do it? Don't kill Santa. I have to quick save, it's fine. Ah, oh, he's invincible. Well, yeah, he's Santa. Okay, that's a valid point. The only way you can kill Santa is if he falls off a roof. That's right, and then you become Santa. <laughs> oh god, this horse or reindeer is so much slower. Yeah, I'm starting over from scratch, but it's worth it. It's worth it. The question is, 
if Brienne pushes Santa off the roof, does Brienne become Santa? I don't see why not. <clears throat> well, I'm not sure the, the beard would really look all that great on Brienne, but... Wow. I, you know, that would probably hurt Brienne's feelings if you told her that. Who's this guy? Who are you? What are you doing here? Oh, okay. Over here. You need, like, a name tag or something like that. Also, I saw something over here. I'm just kind of curious. It was goats. Well, no, I'm not talking about the goats. Look a little farther and you'll see... Ooh, there's a dragon burial mound. It'd be awkward if Alderman just showed up. And right dragon attack. <laughs> That's how those work sometimes. <laughs> I think... Is this the road up here? I wanted to take... No. I wanted to go... Oh, actually, I should have gone back here. Whoops. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Well, this is what happens when you kill Santa. I guess that's a valid point, but I have to also mention I did not kill Santa. Oh, there's, damn it, I missed my opportunity to show you new, new fancy mod that I got. Oh my god, what? No. Oh, it's going to outrun me. Man. Thankfully, they don't take much to go down, but... Yeah, they, they take more damage than the other ones do. Well, I mean, yeah, they're ice wolves. Yeah. So I get that, but... Oh, uh, well. Right. Where is this quest at? Um, Somewhere up over the yonder. I think I'm on the right path. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just I'm off the path, but that's I can get back on it. There it is. Oh yeah, that's our destination. Yay! Right here. <laughs> that's a a great view right there. Yeah, that was interesting. All right, I remember this. So I. I good. Good day, sir. I would assume that we have to fight someone. I think you are correct, even though... Oh, okay, you are me. I was going to say hi and good day. Wish you a Merry Christmas, because I'm now unofficially Santa because I'm riding a reindeer. But someone decided to go with violence. But someone's rude. It's like this guy's getting death in his stocking. No, oh, he's not getting death in his stocking. He's getting it brought right to him. <laughs> He's getting it Tooth Fairy style. Damn, Farkas. Okay. <laughs> Respect. I'll try to make this quick. Yeah, these guys are low level, so I'm just gonna loop as I go. <laughs> No disrespect or anything. Not at all. <laughs> yeah, of course not. Then I meet one. Okay, I don't care. Um... Arcus, settle down. Jeez, we don't need to be having the Geneva Convention violated here. I'm going to be committing war I mean, crimes. I he was using a. Uh... Chemical, chemical weapons or anything. That's a good point. But wait, that brings up the point, though. What makes that... What about poison weapons, then? Does that technically mean that you are committing a war crime if you're using a poison weapon? Um... Uh, well, in the case of Skyrim, no, because... The there Geneva is no convention, convention doesn't... Yeah. <laughs> There is no Geneva in Skyrim, not that I know of. You can't violate the Geneva Convention if there is no Geneva Convention. That's true. Well, if we made our own, though. Well, if we made the White Run Convention. Or better yet, the Markarth Convention, because literally it's just, I don't know, it's a miserable city. I just like talking about how much I hate Markarth. <laughs> it's my passion in life. That's what keeps me going every day. All right, anyone else need to get chopped? Looks like they wised up. Well, either that or they're all dead. Yeah, that, that, that is a possibility. All right, so is this the uh, the Dwarven Ruin? That would be right. 
that's what I was the the sense that I was getting from this place. I would hope so because dwarven ruins are they're pretty obvious. Mm -hmm. It's just a long. So I Brienne wanted to rest up real bad because she knew where she was going and yeah, it takes a minute to get through these bad boys. They're also can be. That's a valid point, Farkas. But we're gonna what make it work anyways. Should we use, though? I wonder why their first instinct is to immediately attack someone. Because they're bandits. Ow, bastard. Stop running! Jesus! Okay, I guess that's they why do you're running. Pitiful damage. I mean. Oh, <laughs> you don't need one of those. Heads are optional. That'll teach him for sure. Man, I kind of want Santa's hat now, and I just kind of want to like make that like Brienne's aesthetic, you know? Commits <laughs> to the pit. She, you know, she she strongly believes in Santa. That's for sure, because she is Santa. You believes in Santa so much that she ends up killing Santa. Well, she's got to become Santa somehow. There can only be one. And then one day someone's going to kill Brienne, and they're going to become Santa. It's a circle of life, David. Come on. Okay. Mm. That's how it works. It ends up being one of the dwarven mechs. Oh, God. <laughs> and then we have a replay of Santa Claus 2. Yeah. <laughs> The fact that that's actually kind of correct is, <laughs> yeah, I didn't even intend it for that. It, it, it's how it be sometimes. It's how it be sometimes. All right, is there anything back? Here? Man, I felt like there was gonna be a hidden chest or something back here. That's very disappointing. Oh well. All right, let's keep on delving and slaughtering bandits. Chomp. Chomp. These guys are really pathetic. Yeah, they are. I should be saying chop, not chomp. Whoops, that's a little yeah. embarrassing, but that's okay. Yeah. yeah, you should be embarrassed. Every day for the last 25 years. Ugh. Ooh, just... 25 and a half today, right? Oh yeah, it is 25 and a half today. Look at you remembering my <laughs> half birthday better than me. <laughs> Look at you remembering my half birthday more than my actual birthday. Hey, you doing? Oh, hi there. You a bad time hi there. Uh oh. <laughs> Imagine just opening a door and seeing that. Oh, I thought someone opened the door. <laughs> oh, thanks for the key. Um, let's see here. Oh, I'll take one of those. Is this the door that we are unlocking? Uh oh. Oof. Oh, that's right. These guys don't let you do that. There's someone up there. Run! Wow, they're just like out here fighting for their life, and then there's that one guy just chilling up there. And <laughs> well, I mean, to be fair, he had a ranged weapon, so like. I know, I know. I'm talking about the guy that's up there and in, in the previous. Oh, room. okay. All right. Yeah, why? Like, why did they have the door locked? If uh, it wasn't locked there. actually, but. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for that, Farkas. You know, I, I appreciate it. it it's a well-meaning warning. Um, let's see. Oh. Ooh, let's take the potion any day. Um, just to sell it later. Ooh, Garnet. Hell yeah. I'll take one of them. 
No, I just remembered. We have a house that we were working on building, and we haven't built that thing up in quite a minute. Immediately runs back to the house. Forgets the dungeon. All priorities. I, no, I'm, I'm not going doing the that. Wrong way. I know, there's this over here. I want to check it out. Uh, anything in here? Nope. Anything over here? See? See? This is why you explore. And is there anything actually over here? Yeah, I just got potions. And alchemy ingredients. And a chest with stuff. Okay. Cast iron pot. I want the wooden sword. Alright, have that. Um, I don't need the cast iron pot. That's okay. I'll pass on that one. Okay, but, cool. I know, I'm sorry. You know, if if you watch Lord of the Rings closely, you learn very quickly that a pot or a pan is a very effective weapon. I mean, I got that from Tangled as well. Okay, fair enough. But Samwise <laughs> did it first. And Rapunzel did it funnier. I don't know about that. Oh, I see you. Ah, don't chalk. That's not very nice. Ow. Alright, that was just one of you. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, to be fair, you just hit something that casts lightning with a metal sword. I know, I know. It's probably not the best move, but also, what choice do I have? Oh, one of these bad boys. Dangerous arrows. I would have loved if that thing just came back to life. That would be tragic. Those things are actually kind of hard to fight. I'm not looking forward to fighting one of those. Whenever that's going to happen. Are these like holding cells? Looks like it. Oh no, this one's just storage. Uh, I mean, it's a holding cell for pots. Apparently. Poor pots. What'd they do? I want to know. Gotta find out. Nope, 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 nope. No. Nope. Nope. Snow clubs. <laughs> Victory was within grasp. Is someone there? I would love to. <laughs> yeah, nothing. <laughs> I was preemptively. Brian, swimming. it's dead. <laughs> it's dead. Settle down, Brian. It's dead. Oh, thanks. Never has to have one of those. Um, what does it do? Uh, it reduces shout time by 20%. I'm not going to probably clip it right now because I like my other thing more. But mm -hmm. It's a good thing to have on hand if I want it. Yeah. Also, Brienne strongly still believes in Talos. So that's a key part of her character. You have decided. <laughs> I, it was decided many moons ago. But she sees it in the long term with not, you know, need the Empire to survive, otherwise uh, Skyrim will fall to the Thelmore. Uh, we can't have that. No, we cannot. Elf Nazis. Literally, though, it is just Elf Nazis. Oh, God! Not very nice. I mean, I was just leaving his friend right in front of him, but to be fair, I didn't know he was there. I mean, they're robots. They don't really feel feelings. You don't know that? How does Wally feel about that? Huh, David? Did you think about Wally? Forgot about Wally. Didn't you? Oh, now uh, different continuities matter to you? Mm hmm. But it's convenient for me. That's the important bit. Hmm. Right. Dead like a boomer. <laughs> um. Oh, I think. Okay, I need to get that open over there. Yeah, um... it must have been something in a different part that you couldn't see. So if I flip this, does that open that up? It does open that up. It's unnatural. You'll be all the machines if you ask. Okay, that closes that. Alright, bye Fergus. Uh. <laughs> B 
Be smarter than the puzzle, bud. That closes the Go back. into that room and flip that one. Alright, now go back. Flip that one. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> it's about ready to give up puzzle. Tries for two seconds. Alright, now go back. Go back. Went back here. All right. I'm gonna let you. Yep. There you go. There we are. Oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. I thought I had it for a second. Just spend the 20 minutes later thing. Whatever. I said that completely wrong. 20 minutes later. Yeah, that's it. We'll get Man, there. You, suck at <laughs> you wanna do it? It's these things suck. Master I... master locks suck. Ooh, damn it, I thought I heard it move. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Rip. <laughs> it requires um, right more down. Okay, more down that still, yep. Do, 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 do. Nope, too far down. Up. Well, yeah, now, now we gotta go. Wait. Yes, hallelujah. <laughs> oh, okay. Alright, alright, alright. What was that? Staff of Zombies? Something like that, yeah. Hey, Farkas. Can I help you? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Yes, you can. You're going to get a staff of zombies. An Orcish War Axe, and a wooden sword, and an Orcish Bow, some arrows, some of that, some of that, some of that, some of that, some of that. You're not getting da Daedric, though. You're not worthy. Um, oh, wait, no. I'm going to take that back, because that's implying something. I'll give you a name of powers. Um, that, that's like the, the flirty oh, um, okay. amulet. Sorry, Mar Marcus. I see you more as a friend. Let's go. Oof. Sorry, buddy. I I feel for you, Farkas. <laughs> Every man does. All right. But I think on that note. This would be a good spot to put in a cut, and then we'll continue on through the Dwarven Ruins. Alright. See you guys in the next part.